Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Crashy and today I've got a really fun video for you. So yesterday, the content cowboy himself, Yeehaw Spraggles, invited me to play some duos while he was streaming. We had a really fun time, got to talk about a whole bunch of different topics, but I just picked out one of the games. We were kind of dominating in lane a little bit and just having a good time. It's always a fun time hanging out with Spraggles. If you guys don't know him, of course you do. You gotta follow this man. He's He's good at the game, he's funny, he's got a great mustache, and all in all, he just seems like a really chill dude to me. So, I love spending time with Spraggles, talking about the game, playing the game now, and hope to do it again in the future. So I hope y'all enjoy this video. Drop me a comment, let me know. Should I play with Spraggles some more? Let me know, let me know. All right, enjoy it. Crashy, okay. Uh -huh. Hey Spraggles, your videos saved my marriage, thank you. Ah, oh, well, that, you know, you got, <laughs> you got more problems than these two picks, I'm sure of it. Let's eat some ape bombs for dinner. I like the taste of ape bomb. I was gonna say we could always call top lane and do an invade strat too. One of us could hang around. Okay, they have the nine tails. Got it. Ugh. Got it. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I hate trying to cast on a wild Pokemon in a fight like that. Yeah, I once I get it. my confusion, we can do some some web things. Oh, that's not how I wanted that to go. Oh, he could still he could still headbutt out of that. Yeah, earlier I was playing Yawn Flail Snorlax, and I was uh, putting these Garchomps to sleep as they dashed at me. So they'd dash at me and be asleep the whole dash, and oh, wake wow. up, and, like they'd land wherever they were gonna land asleep. It was pretty fun to watch. All right, I'm coming. Do you have a, a web up? I got web. All right, cool. On you then for web, if you can catch somebody with it. Okay, going in with the wall combo. Oh, I lost vision of him, but okay, we uh, got we got the eject uh, button. That's uh, not bad. Let me know on your next web. Uh, I'm ready. Go for it. Oh, I might. Okay, that's big. That's big. That's big. There it is. There's the setup. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kite around. That's all you. That's all you. It's so good. I love it. I feel like this is one of those lanes where it's like we're playing like like Mime's not inherently meta, but obviously Mime's not bad, and Pikachu is fairly off meta, but it, it creates such a strong lane that it's surprisingly good. Do you have a web? Not, no, almost. Yeah. You ready? Yep. Oh wait, kind of low. Ooh, I'm kind of low. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait. We'll wait on this one. Let me grab a berry right quick. Let me know when you have that web up. Got it. Let's do it. Oh, I didn't miss it. I missed the stun. I had it too far. Oh, okay, well we got the eject button. We'll take that. I, and I have a, I have my score shield on, so. Okay, wait for it. She's actually behind where her positioning should be. So, oh, I didn't put my barrier out. Sometimes I do that. Whoa, that's a, that's a bird. I didn't know he was coming. That is an angry bird. It was mean. I'm gonna head bottom. Oh wow. Okay, I'll probably stay for 720 bees and then I'll rotate down. Okay. Yeah, I still have two top here, so that should be a decent. Got one of them. Okay, so I got some of these bees here. There's still two tops, so right now we're kind of chilling. Oh yeah. If you can, if you can keep people top, I would never leave it. Yeah, if you if you end up finding yourself like in a or yourself in like a situation where it's like straight mirror, I think it's worth staying top for the farm. Like right now they're missing, so I'm probably gonna head bottom. Yeah. Yeah. I okay. Think, I mean, of course, mirror is pretty good. I kind of still would like to be at dread, but um. Oh, nice. If, if you're that. not, if you're keeping two people occupied, which sometimes people make that horrible mistake and keep two. Oh top, yeah, they stay there. It is the best possible situation for everybody. Oh, he surfed away. All right, back to the top lane I go. Oh. Yeah, I, I do love playing Mr. Mime. I like it. I'm just bad with it. Oh, got her on the wall. Ooh. Could be. This could Ooh. be profitable. Ooh, got the eject button. Ooh. Ooh. Don't you wish you could keep the electro web? Man, yeah, it's so good, right? Oh, there I go. 
I'm probably dead here. I don't think I can get out from that positioning against me. Oh, I believe in y'all though. Oh, no, oh, that's no, no. that's oh, potentially no. diveable. Yeah, I was gonna say that's that and I, I think our Garchomp or our Gabite is doing it. Oh, they probably could have, but I thought from that. All right, we could probably get this Rotom for sure. Nice job dunking six, Garchomp. <laughs> I didn't have 40 on me or anything, but go for See, it. See, that's, that's one of those fundamental skills that I think like needs to be present in higher level play, but it's like it just seems to be lost on uh, a large portion of the player base. Like one of those I things. If it's close, I don't mind at all. I don't care. Okay, yeah. 30 and I, you had 23. Whatever. That's fine. You dunk six and I have 40 and I am in the middle of my score animation. That feels like you should at least get a $500 fine <laughs> or something like that. I'm not saying jail time crash, but if you don't pay your fine, you got to go to jail. I, I, I agree. I get it. Totally agree. What is our Garchomp running? This is an interesting build. Interesting items, interesting battle item. Yeah, assault vest. I, I was think... thinking it kind of makes sense only because, well, it doesn't make sense. That's not the right word. <laughs> but it's not impossible to run something like that because it's not like you're uh, in battle all the time. You have to, like, choose your engagements, but still, it just feels like a mistake. Yeah, I think the big thing for me in Assault Vest is just the fact that you have to be out of combat for that long. Like I've been talking, I did a, I did like a little mini breakdown about items and what I, what like what direction I would like to see them go in. And um, one of my thoughts that I've had for all items is that I, I want them to put less flat stats on the items and more stat scaling on the items. The items actually are just good throughout the full course of the game and not just like front loaded. Um, and especially for items like say Shell Bell and Floatstone, like those items, they they basically provide little to no value at all because the the effect is just not worth not taking something that has like a percentage scaling or like a better item effect um but i think that could be really cool if they if they took some of those items that are like eight seconds out of combat and make it like three seconds because eight seconds in a 10 minute game is that's a long time in and out of combat yeah i totally agree it needs to be a lot shorter i was thinking if you cut it in half it's maybe viable so maybe yeah four seconds and it's funny because i think if i remember correctly i can't remember somebody was talking to me about it they they like given me the information there's like an item that acts similarly in league of legends and league of legends you know those games are marginally longer than unite and the the item still is less than eight seconds out of combat so it's like whoa that, that should be like a clear indicator that maybe eight seconds is too long this Garchomp wants to keep the pressure on. We could. I mean, there are a lot of them going bottom, so I guess we could. Oh, that's oh, a Talonflame ultimate. Yeah. It's hard to get me to stop saying uh, kills and ults, you know? Oh, I'm never going to not say those for sure. It's, it's difficult. It is incredibly difficult not to say those terms. I am definitely MOBA at heart. This much yeah. is true. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Ooh, mean, it's not nice. It's not Why nice, but it just feels nice. so good. I might All get right. some of our buffs before we go into the Zapdos arena. I could see if they tweak leftovers it being a super good item for certain people. If they oh, just yeah. How long it takes. I've actually been like sometimes running leftovers on blissey because if i if my understanding of how the item works i don't think that like being in a fight counts as being in combat so i think you ha i think that blissey can stay out of combat and kind of run around with passive healing on it's pretty interesting really i'm not 100 percent sure but i've been i've been kind of messing around with it Oh, I've got my ultimate on in the back line. Their attackers are faltering to my will. Ooh. Ooh. I think we can do this, probably. Yeah, we we may not well. need to, but the talent flame's on oh, screen. Here. There he is. Oh well, we'll we'll we'll, we'll, we'll make here, some light right? we'll make some light work of that. I'll put a wall up in the in the path, and that belongs to us now. Pikachu is one of my favorite Pokemon that is not good enough to play. I, I completely agree. Incredibly fun to play, but just really falls short. I think it's the mascot. You gotta make him better. I wonder if they're gonna buff him mobile release. He's the Pokemon that's released in the game. Yeah, that is true. Yeah.